up? This is Gretchen Nalunan, aka the one and only Gretchen Namundo. And for today's vlog, we're going to El Nido, Palawan. So, ayan na sa airport tayo na yun, and we're going to check in today. So, tara, let's go! This is the new look of Naia Terminal 4 that mainly focuses on domestic flight. And since there is no private lounge for El Nido specifically, this is the lounge where we stay. So, ayan guys, magbo-boarding time na tayo. During our way to the airplane, they gave out this free umbrella so that we can comfortably go to the airplane. And this airplane managed by AirSwift is at a 70 capacity passengers. During our arrival at the Leo Airport, we are actually fetched by the Huni staff that guide us to the van that we are going to use in order to go to the hotel. And as you can see in the background, the airport is surrounded by nature. Ayan, so nakasakay na tayo ng van and on the way na tayo sa Huni. So, ayan guys, papakita ko sa inyo ang surroundings ng Leo Airport Terminal. at Huni for our first day. So, dito muna kami titira sa hotel na ito. And then, later tayo mag-explore ng rooms and yung mga adventures that is waiting for us here in El Nido, Palawan. So, let's get it! Huni is a small hotel but the environment and atmosphere is very cozy and comfortable. Their staffs are very friendly and approachable. Ayan guys, so another welcome drink. So this is actually made of lemongrass and it's really cold. Perfect for this hot wow. weather. Yes. Ayan, thank you, thank you so much to Kuya Vig. Thank you, Paul. <laughs> comes to the Huni Hotel. So, ito yung a two-minute walk lang starting from our room and this is the view. Yan. At gulo-gulo na ang hair ko. <laughs> Also able to see a hermit crab. Ayan guys, so naglakad lakad tayo sa front beach ng Huni and ayan nagcollect lang tayo ng little shells. So cute, no? <laughs> Pero madami pa dun at least. And may mga malit na features that really shows the sign na preserved talaga ang area as well as inalagan talaga nila ang nature. So ayan, ba tayo mo simula lunch mo na tayo and then let's explore. 
Ngayon, minasan, so, bumalik muna tayo sa Huni, yung ating hotel accommodation for day number one to freshen up para mamaya punta ulit tayo sa beach kung saan tayo unang <laughs> naglagpot siya at yung tawag pala sa beach na yan is Leo Beach. So, literally, beach. Nani? Beach front <laughs> talaga siya. And, yun, punta tayo sa room natin dahil papakita ko sa inyo kung ano yung insura niya. Um, sabi nila, ang forest front naman siya. So, may kita mo yung trees. Yeah. We stayed at a family suite that can accommodate up until four people. The overall room is very spacious and comfortable that you can really relax upon since you have a lot of selections when it comes to the channels and the TV. They also provide basic necessities such as shampoos in the CR and when you look outside, the forest front is such a great place to relax and unwind with everything of life stress. We were also able to see some creatures going in and out of the forest. Ayan guys, so pupunta na tayo sa town ng Ilido. So, sakay tayo ng van to get there to get lunch. Ayun, Inasan, so nag-rent kami ng van papunta sa may bandang town. So, maya-maya pupunta kami sa may canopy. So, makita nyo, banda doon siya. Sana hindi umalan. And, gagawin muna naman is magda-lunch kami. So, titingin kami sa mga restaurants available within the town. restaurant na Happy Home. So, napanood namin to sa isang YouTube vlog and we will also try it kung masarap ba talaga, no? So, this is Happy Home located lang sa town and, uh, ayan, katapat niya lang talaga ang um, beach. So, masarap kaya? Tikman natin! So, ayan, minasan, nandito na ang ating food at ang in-order natin ay fish steak. So, Pwede na tayong kumain! Ayan, Minasan! So, tapos na tayo kumain sa Happy Home Restaurant. And overall, masarap yung food. Yung in-order ko, or kaya yung kinain ko once again, is yung fish steak. So, sulit siya sa presyo na dahil madaming side dishes. And then, masarap pa yung luto. Tsaka ito, ito pa yung katapat nyo. Beachfront talaga yung restaurant. So, ang susunod naman natin na gagawin is we're going to the canopy. So, yung isang canopy is like that. Ah. Yung sobrang tangkad na yan. So, we will try to climb it habang maaraw pa. Dahil medyo umuulan-ulan na sa mga panahon na ito. So, doon tayo dadaan sa sa town ulit and then we're going to go up. So sabi sa amin, meron two stages yung canopy na yun. We have the first stage which are for the beginners and yung level 2, stage 2 is medyo mahirap. So titingnan natin kung kaya ba natin or hindi. So let's go! Naglagay tayo ng safety harness, such as the helmet and this one. And hinihintay na lang yung orders to get ready so that we can go, go, go for it. So, so. In order to do this activity, you just need to sign some waiver and consent forms to proceed with it. Ayan, minusan. So, nag-start na tayo sa canopy walk. So, nasa entrance tayo and unti-unti tayo akyat. So, since kami lang naman yung tao dito, pinatanggal na sa amin yung mask namin. Tingnan nyo na lang yung mga um, obstacle. So, yun, minasan, hindi natin nakuha na yung packet kasi kailangan both of my hands para makaakit talaga. So, kukuha na talaga natin yung mga kayang kuhanan for this canopy walk na. Pero overall, enjoy. Ang lamig ng hangin dito. 
Maramdaman mo talaga fresh yung air. Tsaka, ayun, ang ganda. Okay, guys, ko na Nice zoom. So, ayun guys, nasa flying bridge tayo. Tsaka, naglagay tayo ng little harness for protection, no? So, ayan. Thank you so much, eh, kuya, sa pagkuha. <laughs> Ano pangalan niya, Kuya? Ernie po, Ernie. Ernie, kay Kuya Ernie sa magkuha mo. <laughs> Ay, magalan ko. Ha? Magalan ko. Ay, sorry. Basta kaya mami, step, step. Okay, sorry yun sa mama. Kaya niya yan. Oh my goodness. Ayan guys, kung marinig yun. Kasi matasya, guys. So, nakalula talaga sa mga may takot sa heights. Pero, overall, enjoy! <laughs> Ngayon kahaba ang bridge. At ang pangit kong broad. <laughs> so, ayan, guys. Akyat uh, kami dito. Bibitawan ko ulit ang phone ko. Para, syempre, safe tayo sa pag-akyat. Ah! Ito daw mga limestone na to, sabi ni Kuya Ernie ay buhay pa and parang millions of years na daw tanda ito and simula pa na to yung paniniwala na lubog ito sa dagat dati. So kung makikita niyo yung structure, parang ganito siya and yung mga bumps, bumps na yan, sabi ni Kuya Ernie ay galing sa ulan so parang yung chemical reaction ay ginagawa ito and ayan! Malapit na tayo matapos sa ating mini um, canopy walk. Kakapagod din kasi mainit. Pero ang enjoy talaga, no? Ang ganda ng view. Malamig yung hangin. At saka natatawa kay mami kasi sigaw ng sigaw. <laughs> so, ayan. Tuloy na natin. Ayan. So, malapit na tayo magtapos sa ating mini canopy walk. And may kita na natin ang um, sinasabing view ni Kuya Ernie in a few seconds, no? So, um, kung makikita nyo, daming limestone talaga. Buhay pa yung mga limestones na yan. And, ganda talaga. Dinis ng hangin. At masarap talaga pasukan, no? So, So, yun, yun ang tinatawag po nila ba ito dito is a limestone. So, solid na mineral ang tawag. Um, may halo siyang solid na mineral po. Kaya po, pag naka-separate siya, uh, may sounds na yun siya o parang yung lightning na ito. Pag buo pa siya, lagyan ko na po, wala po siya sa mm. Thank you, Kuya! <laughs> so, yun na nga. Tapos na ang Kanopi Walk. Thank you so much to Palawan, X Adventures, as well as Kuya Ernie for helping us get sa Kanopi Walk itself. Tsaka sa Explanation sa mga gandang view. So, ayan na na kayo susunod na activity natin. Let's see. So, ayan, minasan nakapag-freshen up na tayo at nakabiis na tayo para pumunta sa Leo Beach once more. At hindi na, ano, hindi na puro sa legs. Pwede na tayo mag-swimming, swimming. So, ayan, tara. Let's go. Let's go to the beach and let's... Nandigo tayo na yan sa Leo Beach. So, sakto maganda kasi sunset. Pero natakpan ng clouds. Tsaka mainat din yung tubig. Akala ko malamig. So, tamang-tama after mag-canopy walk. Okay na okay. Pang refresh. Ganon. <laughs> so, yes. Enjoying ng dulo. Dagat! Ganda ng view! Woo! So, ayan, Minasan. So, magdi-dinner na kami after namin magpahinga a little bit. 
as well as mag swimming kanina no. So, mamili pa lang kami ng restaurants around Huni Hotel. And ayun, kita niyo na lang sa susunod na clips kung ano yung pinili namin at kamusta ba sila. This is the sunset that goes with the Leo Beach and uh, you can really feel how relaxing and beautiful it is watching it while there are some music and bands going upon around. And when we walk upon the Leo Beach itself, we were also able to see numerous restaurants that goes along with it. But in the end, we chose two restaurants which is Mexican food that is in this jeepney as well as El Nido Grill. So, ayun guys, nag-order kami sa may Mexican na jeep outside as well as dito sa El Nido Grill. So, dumating na ang sa Mexican and papakita ko sa inyo kung ano ang in-order namin at kung ano ang lasa niya. We ordered their best-selling tacos that mainly goes with chicken as well as beef. And looking upon it, they serve two tacos overall in one order. So, ayan, titikman na natin ito. This one. Ito, chicken. Nasa pa talaga yung flavor ng chicken. At may smoky flavor siya. Tamang-tama yung spiciness. Tsaka yung, um, yung mga vegetables na kagagdag talaga sa lasa. Overall sarap. On the other side, in El Nido Grill, we ordered grilled squid, ensalada, and grilled pork liempo. These three dishes are really delicious since you can really savor the flavor as well as the smokiness that goes along the grilling aspect of the cooking. And I really love the food here since it is worth the price as well as your money. So, yung once again, marama ra sa lang, minasan po, us tuning in, and sarang yung minasan. Adios, adios, bye bye. See you in our next vlog.